Chuck Norris gave up his movie career to care for his sick wife. She's dying. She's dying right in front of me here at this hospital. But he wasn't always so caring. No, Chuck used to be a cheater. He shamelessly betrayed his first wife. He had a brief affair that resulted in a huge, tragic sensation. Many years later, out of the blue, Chuck received a mysterious letter. A woman named Dina claimed to be his biological daughter. Dina told him a mind-blowing story. When she was 16, she overheard her mother talking to a friend, saying she'd had a love affair with the legendary actor. Dina was shocked. She wanted to meet her dad, but her mother begged her to wait. Chuck Norris already had two kids with his first wife, and the news about his secret daughter could have ruined everything. As a result, Dina was hidden from Chuck for 26 years. Only when her dad got divorced did she decide to act. Dina's letter reached its destination right into Chuck's heart. He was broken. He'd had no idea that Dina even existed. Deep inside Chuck was always a man of honor. Unlike many Hollywood heartthrobs, Norris never doubted Dina was his daughter. Instead of suing her and her mother, he did the most noble thing possible. He immediately met them. I didn't need DNA or blood tests. I went to her, wrapped my arms around her, and we both started crying. Chuck still remembers how he felt when he saw Dina for the first time. It was as if he'd known her all his life. In his autobiography, Chuck admitted that during his affair, he openly lied to Dina's mother. To my shame, I never told Joanna that I was married, which made his cheating even worse. He behaved like he didn't even have a wife. When Chuck realized the consequences of his lie, something clicked inside him. No more lies, no more cheating. Family first. Chuck and Dina still spent time together, even after he married American model Gino Kelly, with whom he had two more kids. Now, Norris travels together with his big family, but unfortunately, life still threw some hard challenges at him. Chuck and his new wife, Gina, seemed to be so happy, but a tragedy was round the corner. I saw death in her eyes. I saw her dying, and I said, you know, I've got to do something. It all started when Gina went to the hospital to get her arthritis checked out. But what should have been a routine test turned into a nightmare. Before her MRIs, Gina was injected with a contrast agent. It's not usually harmful, but for some mysterious reason, it almost killed Gina. The doctors saw she was in incredible pain, and Gina described it as, I'm burning. I, that's all I can tell you is I'm burning all over. I feel like I have acid everywhere in my tissues. She couldn't swallow or even breathe properly, but nobody knew what was wrong with her. One thing became clear to Chuck. He needed to save his wife, whatever the cost. I can take her anywhere in the world. I'm blessed enough to have the money to do that. But where do I take her? And when he realized that Jean was poisoned with an MRI contrast agent, he found the best hospital in the world to help her. He hired the best specialists, spent over $2 million for treatment, and didn't leave Gina alone for a moment. Yes, Chuck spent dozens of nights sleeping on the couch right next to her in the hospital. The actor was scared like he'd never been before. He was haunted by his past and that he'd betrayed a woman and left his daughter to grow up without a father. And he promised to never harm his family again. My whole life is focused on keeping her as well as I possibly can. You know, I've had to give up my film career. That's true. Since 2012's The Expendables 2, we haven't really seen him starring anywhere. Yes, there were some minor guest appearances like in Hawaii Five-0, but that's about it. And we've yet to know how many big roles Chuck rejected. Luckily, his wife Gina feels much, much better today. Chuck sued the medical company for $10 million for poisoning her. Unfortunately, after years of unsuccessful processes, he decided to drop the lawsuit. And despite not punishing those responsible, he was able to keep something way more important. The life of his beloved. Chuck Norris proved to the whole world that he really is a real-life ranger and that family always comes first.